<laughs> Welcome back to more combat. Hey, ladies. Oh, my ears messy. <laughs> uh, hey, good morning. So right now it is 7:26 in the morning. It's just it was beautiful yesterday. No cold. So 7:26. Yep. So today we might think of something else. You know, for a change. So I noticed E. Whatever his name is, Mask. He changed the logo on Twitter. That you guys always hate. Because Twitter has a blue bird, not the X. Yeah. Freaking mask really pissed off at everyone. So, right now, it is early sunlight. Early morning. Look at that beautiful orange. Holy shit. And more fog. Right. <laughs> but that's a beautiful orange right there. Damn. So, yeah, I just woke up about 6, what time, I woke up about 6.15, I woke up, oh well, no worry about it, tomorrow I gotta go to, um, tomorrow night I gotta go to the engineering class, hopefully I finish the last assignments, then finish off the toolbox, then that's that, so, Hopefully, I'll finish in time, get that certificate, and I can work. But seriously, last month, I thought um, I'll finish on the 28th, but nope. They changed the date to whatever time. So, yeah, but right now I'm just chilling TV. Just checking it and watch sync. Plus, I'm going to have my morning coffee as well. Uh, I don't mind. It's in my coffee cup cut. But, co um, but first coffee. It says coffee first. It's a but on there. I want to get rid of that. It says first coffee, you know. But first coffee. Yeah, there's a butt in my coffee. Well, I need to explain why there's a butt in there. <laughs> Sorry about that, agents. So, yeah, I'm up to episode five on my um, series. But the thing is, I need peace and quiet to do all my series. So, uh, there's got to be a pain. So right now, let's turn on the heat mat and the heat lamp for these two beautiful dragons. I gotta go shopping for them today. Go go shopping for their food. It's nearly their, their breakfast time anyway. Well, I might turn them on about 10. Leave them asleep a little bit longer. Yeah, that's a good idea. Leave them asleep for a little bit longer so they can rest up a lot. It is their sleeping time anyway. Uh, so, yeah. But right now, um, about the storybooks, I haven't been writing that much because I've been busy with a whole lot of things, and I haven't, I have not been writing for that much. So I might start writing again. But yeah, the fog, holy shit. You can't even see the field. Great. And that's the thing. You can't even see the field in that fog. It's thick. And I know that's what she said. Jeez. Yeah, you're bringing it easy on me. So right now, I'm going to watch something while I drink my coffee, and I'll see you guys at about 10. 
so we can turn on these two beautiful dragons to wake up so I'll see you guys probably later okay it is now 10 or 5 in the morning and right now my dad's replacing the old tub with the new one so it doesn't leak everywhere so right now let's turn on the light for the beautiful dragons yeah, check out how they are going. So, yeah, Tylenol was wrong about the dragons. They're not too hard to look after. Snakes are, but not lizards. Hey, baby. Good morning. Good morning, gorgeous. How you doing? You're my beautiful girl. You're my big boy. Hello. Yeah, white people are good boy. Hey. That's my girl. He used to stay in the warm, hey? That's my girl. That's my baby boy. But listen, I'm staying the warm in the mulch. So that's a good thing. So right now I'm just gonna keep on my beer dragons all all the times. So, yeah, my beer dragons have been doing very good. So far, so good. So, yeah, it's been really good. So these arrows right here, they need to be fixed. They just need new knocks. And that's that. But with my compound bow, I need more arrows because I've, I've lost two and I, bro I broke a f few of arrows so yeah this one this arrow here is from my black eagle arrow and you can see that's the part of the fiberglass body with the arrowhead the arrowhead on the other ones look how thick it is that's thick alloy so that's a nice arrow, but the whole um, top um, part of the fiberglass body actually broke off. So, yeah, even I lost a black eagle arrow as well. It's in the bush somewhere. I ain't got one left, and that's it. Plus, I haven't seen my friend Dave for a while. Now, I see him months ago, but. These, these three months I've been going to archery, I haven't seen him at all. So hopefully I, I'll see him soon, but hopefully he's, he's okay. I haven't seen him for a while, so that's one thing. So about my bit of dragons, when I, when I get my own place, they're going to get a bigger enclosure, more bigger than these. These glass tanks, like this one and the other two in the garage, I'm going to use for babies and young adults. Chevy on the other ways, he can stay in the glass tank because he's only a small fella, but he's getting too old. But what I need to do is try to find Stumpy a younger male so she can have her own babies this spring. So she can have her own babies. So I need to fill up the tank with mulch up to here. So it goes along here, it goes down to the shallow bit. So wherever she's digging, she can actually bury her eggs in the warm. So she can have that. So the mulch, I need to put another heat mat, so I need to thread the heat mat wire on this side to go under here so she can have warmth while she's protecting her eggs and this is the thing, I know I know he got baby bear dragons from Charlie but all of them died and rotted and they're from the sand and yeah not very good so yeah that's the thing 
Sand's not very really good. In the wild, bitter dragons, they bury their eggs in mulch to keep their eggs safe and warm and keep safe from predators anyway. And that's a true fact. And I love my bitter dragons. I wanted to find a young male for Stumpy so she can have her own babies this spring. But the thing is, no one has a male like her. She's a... She's the same as Chevy? A Inlin? But Chevy, he's a older male and he's getting old. He, he's like a chilled boy. But right now, Stumpy actually put mulch on him so he can stay warm as well. That's a good thing. Stumpy is treating Chevy as a brother. And not a mate. Because Chevy, he's old. I had him for seven years now. Last month, on the first day, he turned seventh. The seven. Now, today's the first of August. So, if you're on this side of the world, where I am, pinch punch, first day of month, no returns. So, you can't get me back. <laughs> so, yeah. But right now, I got my sunnies. I got my wallet. I got my keys. And I just need to get my phone. So, later on... Uh, well, later after my dad's finished, I'm going to Nikki's Cafe to have a coffee. So hopefully that comes soon. I haven't brushed my teeth yet, so I need to do that first before I go anywhere. So yeah. But right now, my bit of dragons on their ways. They are such a good little kids to me. Uh, I treat my reptiles and my dog like kids. Yeah, they are my children anyway. I don't have human kids because I don't have a girlfriend yet. So, yeah. So right now... Yeah. So, when I get a whole lot of work, and when I go to the places, I want to find um, airsoft to shoot my airsoft rifle. This is my airsoft rifle, it's a World War II Car 98. And it's still in the package, still rubber band. It's got the scope, it's got the stand, it's got balls. <laughs> That's weird what I just said. That's a really big pack of shit. Plus, I got the big containers of those gel balls right there underneath my sword. So. Those two buckets, these and the little packets, that's one, number two's in here somewhere. Ah, oh, there's number two. Yep. And number three. So there's two in there. So, wherever you guys want to invite me to a airsoft rifle battle, I'll bring this to a airsoft um, game. And I'll join your team if anyone wants a sniper. I'm really good at sniping on airsoft. Even on games, I'm really good at sniping. But the thing is, my friends call me a lousy sniper. And how dare they? But they are friends. They don't mean it. But yeah that's my airsoft rifle so if anyone of you guys want to invite me to an airsoft rifle kind of um paintball please invite me so i'll be available but after i work a lot i want to travel to any paintball battle with gels so i can shoot long distance Ah, uh, so, yeah. But, I can't shoot in the backyard because the neighbours will report that as rifles. So, yeah. So right now it's 10.15 in the morning, so I need to 
help my dad and I'll see you guys later when I come back from town so I'll see you guys when I get back well tomorrow morning I'll be doing my episode and I don't give a shit about Call of Duty anymore so right now I'm just checking all my beautiful dragons before I go on top of the mountain hey hey Stampy good doing good doing his baby girl that's my girl that's my baby you love your chin scratch, don't you? Hmm? You love your chin scratch. Kick ya. Kick ya. And my big boy right here. He doesn't like using those rubber anyway. Hi, baby boy. I love you. And my little one. Oh well. There is nothing I can do today. Oh well. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys on top of the mountain. Hey ladies and gents, I am here on top of Mount Parama. And it is looking beautiful today. Nice and clear. Um, let me check my messages first before we um, go out. So right now, um, no, no messages today, that's good. Oh, well, let's go out and have a look on the valley and, and enjoy ourselves. So let's go on. Alright. There's a fire right over there. Okay. There you go. Hmm. Nothing very exciting today. Hmm. There's Eglinton right over there. That small suburb. <laughs> oh well. Such a beautiful time of the day. It's only 1.40, 1.41 in the morning. Well, in the afternoon, not in the morning, what the hell I'm talking about. That is just so beautiful. I don't know why there's smoke over there. Hmm. And then down the truck, you can actually see every car down here, uh, up here. Go around here, up here, down there. And everything else is going to the parking station. I like to call it a good truck anyway. Oh well, but yeah, it's nice and blue, nice and blue skies, no clouds, everything's good. So if you come over here in Australia, come up here, you can actually see the whole valley. And that, uh, this is such a beautiful sight. You can actually see everything up here, even your home suburb, where, wherever you are in this town, you can actually see everything. So, cool. <laughs> oh well, let's get back to the car. Oh, that was beautiful. <laughs> oh well. Let me fix up the seat cover. It's <laughs> rolled up. 
damn it. <laughs> All right. Oh, well, that, that was the valley. Absolutely beautiful. I don't know why is there smoke over on my right, but yeah, it's really weird. Yeah, why there's smoke? Yeah, it looks like there's a fire over there. Oh well. But everything's beautiful. It's nice and green up here. You can actually see the valley. It's all green, not brown. Because every time when it rains, everything goes really lush green. But it's normal green. It's not brown. It's actually green. Oh, well. Uh, let me start the car and... Yeah. It's only... What was it? 1.43 in the afternoon, so... Yeah, it's all good. So right now, uh, yeah, about a couple of hours ago, I've been at Nikki's and I just had a good iced coffee over there. It's the best cafe of all. It, it, I rate this cafe, you know, Nikki's cafe, a ten out of ten. It's more better. It's more handmade food and not sh shop brought. It's all freshly made, but Pina, uh, the chef's son, wants him to buy store brought food, not homemade. So, yeah. But right now, I'm gonna go home, and I'll see you guys back at the Dragon's Den. Till then, I'll see you guys early. Well, ladies and gents, I am back at home, and that view of the valley was absolutely freaking gorgeous. Hell yeah. Now I'm with my beer dragons right now and Stumpy's in the warm. So tomorrow I'll get crickets for my babies. Yeah, let, let, let me get the light on. And pick up Chevy for you guys. Hey baby boy. Hello. Sleepyhead. <laughs> Here's my boy. Here's my boy. <laughs> hey, sleepy. <laughs> hey, baby boy. Look at him. He's a chill boy. Hey, how you doing? Look at him. Look at him. He's chill, isn't he? <laughs> Come on, stay on my hand, eh? Moving backwards. He's not happy. I woke him up. He. <laughs> so, yeah. Let me give him a tickle. I love you. <laughs> He's like, start tickling me. <laughs> okay, I'll pull you back. There you go. There you go. Good boy. Hey, baby. Yeah, it's cold for them. Uh, tomorrow I'll get crickets for them. Yeah, I had to go to the fuel station on the other side of town to, um, to pump up my tire. Yeah, yeah, but it was down. It was just, fuck. Oh, well. But, yeah. It's 2.52 already, shit. <laughs> Man, the time's flying. Oh, well. So right now, I'm going to leave my bear dragons to rest. Oh, look at that. More skin. Shit. Stumpy, did you shed more? Good girl. 
that's one that's two and that's uh leg scales that's good or tail scales and the pieces of it hey baby she is my beautiful girl so yeah tomorrow I'll be working on my episodes I had to friggin try and get it to the part where I was but nope all my friends want me to go on group chat and stuff yeah so yeah so I'm going to do another Core G episode before the Battle Pass ends, and I'll see you guys at 4. Till then, yeah, there, there's nothing I can do. Sit hanging on my beer dragons, or go on top of the mountain. That's all I'm going to do. So I'll see you guys at 4 o'clock. Alright ladies and gents, I am back at home, finally. Oh, what a long fucking day at 7 or 3 at night. And I got home late. Sorry about that, ladies and gents. It's been absolutely fucking long. And I am tired. <laughs> I'm literally... I'm nearly dropped on my knees. I've been helping my little sister get a bookshelf and a coffee table. Then I had to, dri I had to drive all the way to my brother's place to pick up my brother-in-law's dumb brother's and his girlfriend's stuff like bed, side table, chair all that and fuck I'm buggered so I hope you guys love this video if you love this video please leave a like on the right side of the screen subscribe to my channel on Bloom video and comment away down below till then I'll see you guys next time. Till then, um, that is all I'm going to do tonight. And I'm bugged. I'm fucking bugged. I'm tired. I'm worn out. So I'll see you guys next time. Till then, peace for now. Get over here,